now that is an entrance. It's Kevin Grace with Chicago 3 Media, and we are here tonight for the premiere of Chicago Fire, and as you can see, the cast and crew, of course, are arriving in style. Eamon Walker here, bro. You will be Saeed for oh, as forever, forever and bless you for that. Uh, did you see the smile you got from me when you first walked up? I was like, oh my god, I can't wait. I'm, I'm going to be interviewing him. Dude, I lived for Oz, and your character on Oz was amazing. And we're not here to talk about that, I know, blah, blah, blah. No, no, we don't hear the we're here to talk about Chicago Fire. How excited are you to be in this? Well, let me make a reference to Oz via this show. Okay, I love Not it. since Oz have I felt the camaraderie awesome. and the ensemble of great actors and 150% given to everything that we do. And bearing in mind that we are in corridors of fire half the time, yes. um, I am really happy and excited to be a part of this crew and this cast. I never thought I could hit, you know, like gold twice. You know, I yeah. know, I know how lucky I am. When the people see this show, they'll go, oh my God. So I'm very, very happy. And, and this man knows his craft, BBC, Mr. BBC here. Yeah, uh, I've been around. I, that's brilliant though, that you feel that camaraderie already. It's fantastic, look, look at that. Uh, and they're not so shabby either. <laughs> what a good looking cast. Have you seen the women in my car? I've seen them all. They're all good. I love them all. Uh, listen, have fun tonight. Enjoy the show tonight. Enjoy your time in Chicago. We're so happy to be here. I'm so happy to meet very, you. Very happy to be in Chicago. What's your name, buddy? I'm Griffin. Griffin, what are you doing on this show, Chicago Fire? Um, I, I play Griffin and Darden, the son of the firefighter who dies. And I'm in the second episode. Uh, well, how much fun was that? Fun. I bet it was a good time. And uh, did you get to see any fires? No. No. Did you ride in a fire truck? No. What? What kind of craziness is that? How are you going to be on a show called Chicago Fire and you're not even on a fire truck? I don't know. I think we need to talk to somebody. <laughs> We're going to have to renegotiate that contract. <laughs> I'm here with Monica. Raymond here. Hello. Tell me a little bit about the show and what you're doing on it. Um, I am playing Gabriella Dawson, the, the officer paramedic on the show, at, obviously with Chicago Fire and the Firehouse of the Boys. And I'm going out, saving lives, kicking butt, and breaking some rules. Saving lives and kicking butt. And I love it. I love it. How is this different from like The Good Wife? Oh my gosh, what is Completely it different, different right? First of all, I'm not in heels. So it's really nice to revisit my heels tonight because now I feel like I'm back on Saturday. Get, get a look at this outfit. She is smoking tonight. Look at good girl. How are you loving Chicago? I love it. I do. I really love it. I I told I told my husband, I was like, I kind of want to stay here for the next 10 years. Listen, I'm, I'm looking at you. I'm like, Chicago's liking you, I'm sure, girl. I love it here. We got it. We got it. We got Charlie. All right, we got Charlie. All right, listen. So I just met your sister on the the show. I love her. I'm, I think I'm in love with her. I know. She's amazing. She is so beautiful. Beautiful. It makes it a little difficult, uh, you know, but uh, she's a great sister. So you're taking care of her on the show? I am completely. You know, there's people croaching uh, in on her, so I'm going to have to toughen up and show my side, but yeah, yeah. I, I already asked her for a dance leader at the after party. So. Uh, <laughs> well, I got to be up at five, so you can take my spot. But, all right. I'm totally taking the spot. Tell me about this experience, man. Are you loving it? I'm loving it. It's been amazing. It's been incredible. The cast, the crew, Everybody, it's it's the Chicago itself. The city is like another human being. Chicago. I love it. Welcome to Chicago. Thank you very much. Australia, you. Australian guy. I am. I am. I know. Okay, right. Before we before we even start talking about Chicago Fire, I gotta ask, why is it that all the great actors from Australia are on Neighbors? Because it's the only show that we have. It's the only one. Oh no, there's there's Home and Away in Sydney as well. It's like it's like when you're growing up there, the first thing that you do, the staple. Do you know what I mean? It's like it's like the bread and butter of Melbourne television is Neighbours, and you sort of it, if you're gonna do something, it's the first place to go. Well, but so many great Australian actors have come from Neighbours. It's almost it's like yeah. I mean, it's a it's a it's a great learning curve from there. I mean, they there's there's been some great actors on Neighbours, you know, and and they've they've had a long tradition with. Um, you know, kickstarting people along the way, and uh, they do a great job. They're still going. Actually, the parents, uh, the people who play my parents, are still on the show. Are they really? They're still there. They're still there. I could go back. I think you should. If Chicago Fire fails. I could go. No, back. it will not fail. It will not fail. All right. Uh, okay. Music. You also play music. Yeah. Chicago's known for its music. I know. But do you have a? I don't think I play fiddle, so I don't know. We could find you a spot here in Chicago for fiddle. Yeah, I don't know. 
if you have a, a fiddle scene here, oh, really. It's no, huge. Al Alison Krauss is from Illinois, I believe, which I I love Alison Krauss. But See? You're not getting away. You're not getting away. Get yeah. with it. No, 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 no. no. I, it's a tag team. It it's fun. a tag team. Yeah. Um, listen, we can find we can find you that fiddle crowd. We'll find it, Ted. Can you? We'll find you it. You need a bluegrass bluegrass crowd. That's what I need to um, what I need to learn. Bluegrass? Dude? You do? Totally. Really? Yeah, it's all over Where? the place. Where do I go? I don't know. We'll, we'll find out. Let them know later. Chicago School of Folk. Is, is there there is, is up on the north side. That's what I heard. Yeah, yeah. I heard that's the place to go. That's so. where you'll find all that. It's yeah. on Lincoln. It Lincoln, is on, is it's it? Lincoln, just north of Wilson. There's two. There's two. Um, there's two places. They're both up there. You're just saying that. I now. totally am. No. Totally am. I I'm, just trying, I'm just trying. I'm just trying to chop. <laughs> All right, let's talk about Chicago Fire. All right. How amazing is this? Listen, this is great. You know, like we, you know, coming off House, and it was a very, it was a very cerebral show. If you notice in House, that no one even like touches each, touches each other. It's a very clinical sort of thing. And this is, I mean, you know, hanging around. We have the real firefighters on set all the time. Do you know what I mean? So the spirit of it is, is this great? You know, we have. It's, it's basically like turning up to a to summer camp. It's like a brotherhood. It is. It has to. Be. And now, and now we're mates with all the firefighters. I mean, one of them's even on the, on the red carpet tonight. Where's he gone? He's run off. He's worn his suit tonight. Uh, he's taken out a fire. Yeah, he's had like two lines so far, and um, yeah, we're getting them involved. So, so they're learning about acting, and we're learning about fire. As it should be, right? As it should be. Exactly. I love it. Listen, have fun tonight. Thanks. So Enjoy much. this time with Chicago Fire. This is a, an amazing opportunity for all you guys, and we're proud as Chicagoans to have you guys here representing. Thanks so much. We love Chicago. And if you were on General Hospital right now, and you had to say, um, "Baby, there's a, the house is on fire." How would that sound? Baby, the house is on fire. Is that good? That was brilliant. Oh my God, you are so on General Hospital again. I love it. Tell me about this experience. Are you loving it? It's amazing. I mean, working with Dick Wolf has been a dream of mine. The cast is fantastic. I come to set to hang out with them on my days off. Uh, and the, the scripts are just stellar. I mean, the stories they're telling are so authentic and so moving that I just can't wait for people to see it, and I'm so grateful I got to be a part of it. Listen, Chicago 3 Media, you know David from everything, but of course, all the gays will know him from Sex in the City, blah, blah, blah. But now he's a fireman, and he's on Chicago Fire. Dude, how you doing? I'm good. I get to wear $500 boots. I love, I love $500 boots, but mine won't work in the water. Mine do. I know. I bet they do. <laughs> um, okay, you've got a connection to Chicago. Chicago, I believe Naperville. I'm a Naperville guy. Yeah, I, Aurora also, and Northbrook and Evanston. So, but, but you you have a New York sound all the time. Well, my dad was from the Bronx, and I spent 22 years there, so I got a little New York in me. It, it happens. It happens. How do you feel about being here in Chicago now, working in this your hometown? I, I, well, I wish I was from Chicago. I'm a suburb guy, so I'm not going to make airs that I'm not. So I would love to say I was from Chicago. But I'm not gonna. I'm a. I'm a phony most of the time. But I can't be that to Chicago people. Do you know nobody does that though? That's the first time I've ever heard somebody say that. Anyone from like Wheaton, Naperville, Schaumburg, they say they're from Chicago. Oh, uh, Wheaton. If they're from Wheaton, they're a bunch of liars. Ah, liars they are in Wheaton. In Wheaton. <laughs> What? You do not interrupt my interview, lady. Are, uh, are you having fun doing this, though? I'm having the, I'm having the time of my life. I'm having the time of my life right yeah, now. They're good people. It's a, it's a special, special bunch of people. We're really proud of the show. We're proud of you guys. Are you getting to? You're, you're sticking around? Yeah. You're not ducking out, are you? No, I'm not ducking out. I'm sticking it? around. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah totally, no, man. I'm, I'm really proud of the show. I'm good. getting to see. I got to see a few episodes, and and here we'll walk. We'll walk with you. You know, getting to see some of that is yeah, it's it's exciting because you get really excited and then proud to. to <laughs> they're making him, they're making him go. So we're gonna catch up with Taylor later. Thank you, hey, man. Appreciate yeah, it. Bro. So appreciate him, man. <laughs> All right, guys, we've done the red carpet. We've seen the premiere of the show. I mean. How about that entrance? I gotta tell you, this show is really good. NBC is really delivering, and these boys really deliver. All the acting, the camaraderie, it's really good. They're doing Chicago Proud. So remember to watch. The premiere is October 10th at 9 o'clock Central. It's all about Chicago Fire, and it's all about you and Chicago 3 Media. I'm Kevin Grace.